this has been ethyl acetated compared to my acetone and that's a much more aggressive system of doing things so you can see that this model has split hold on I'll zoom in this is what the side effects of uh, acetoning and ethyl acetate are if you're too aggressive your model can split like here and then you can see in the tongue, the teeth have split there. And this, this, this kind of weird, it's not exactly lining, but some of the imperfect layers have been eaten away a bit more than the other ones. So if your coupler is dying, then acetoning and ethyl acetate will bring it right out again. Again, there's a massive split line here, as you can see. And there's another one there. And in fact, there are vertical split lines. I don't know how to... Sorry, it's been in a box for about a year. Um, I, can't, I don't know if I, you can see them, but there are, I guess they're not visible to the light. So, here we go. I don't know if you can see them. But, no, you can't see them. But it's almost like the horizontal split lines. You might see one there. There's this kind of like brick pattern. And it's just split everywhere. So what was a really nice perfect print is now a, a was a nice perfect print. But I will spray it now and we'll see what we can salvage after a little bit of sanding. Okay, see you later. I've filled up my uh, little tank and now I'm just going to spray it and you will see all the crack lines much more clearly. Let's see if it's in focus first. This should actually be clean, I'm just going to brush it down, hold on. So I just got a brush and it's been in my cupboard so long it's gathered a lot of dust and you shouldn't really... Um, spray paint over dust, it's not going to stick very well. It's a dusty brush, I do my acetoning with it, which is a bit stupid, but I can't be bothered to go in the house and get a new brush, so... It will do the job. If it goes wrong, well, you've learnt your lesson, don't use a dirty brush. Yeah, it's not the cleanest of brushes, as you can see. Anyway, here we go. <coughs> the further back you hold it, you get a bigger spread, but it's obviously more diluted. Okay, so that one's done. As you can now see all the cracks in it. Let me just show you those. I was going to do another one quickly, but... So there you have it. Once it's been sprayed, you can see a lot of the imperfections much more clearly. There you go. Crack, 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 crack. more cracking so essentially the model has it's not too bad apart from those cracks but also the general surface as you see here it's not too nice it's like I want it to be perfect if you know me anyway so uh, that's in my opinion that's because I used ethyl acetate on this one in order to try and get it to its you know, to look shiny for a photo. So, uh, yeah, I won't... <coughs> this one's quite a good illustration, actually, of the cracking as well. So here, you can see the manic splitting and weirdness going on. Again, this was ethyl acetate.